Hi everyone, William Quang here from the uh, Adelaide Hill Pain Clinic and SA Running Injury Clinic. Um, so yeah, today, sorry, uh, late late uh, post tonight, um, just uh, so run off our feet this time of the year, everyone, uh, everyone's cramming everything before Christmas. Now, um, today's post is about um, shoes called maximalist shoes. Now these shoes are uh, a lot more thicker throughout the midsole, so obviously quite a distinctive look, they look like moon boots. Um, in many ways, but these are the maximum uh, shoes. So um, every ten years, there's a fad where there's barefoot running. Hey Bridget, how are you? And uh, barefoot running, and then there's also um, those really thin shoes, uh, like your Vibrams. Um, so you know, I guess there was another fad um, just recently, and they decide to go the other way, where they decide to make the midsole really, really thick. Now, um, it's this brand here is called Hocker. They tend to be the um, leaders with maximum shoes. Um, and um, make up uh, pretty much most of the maximal shoes. Now we have really, really good um, success with some of these shoes with specific injuries. Um, our biggest, um, we always pretty much prescribe it if someone has a um, marching or stress fracture in their, um, their long bones of their toes. Um, so that we really do like them for that. Um, they're also quite um, good for um, uh, heel and Achilles issues as well. So they're, they're good for those ones. Um, probably on the other side of the scale, they can actually increase the injury rate with some other injuries such as um, your runner's knee or um, patellofemoral uh, knee pain. So just be a bit wary. Um, they're not as big and heavy as, or they are big, but they're not as heavy as you think as well. Um, also, Hocker, Hocker um, is actually one of the fastest growing uh, brands. I think they're def- uh, they've, they've now jumped up to number six. I think they, uh, one of the marathon uh, surveys said that they're now sixth on the... Um, on the list of most worn shoes. So um, growing in popularity. Um, but yeah, we, we do really like these shoes, um, but it just depends on the actual um, injury. Um, so yeah, I, I haven't run in them. <clears throat> it depends on the day. Sometimes if my um, Achilles or heel is a little bit sore, yes, I do get it occasionally, um, I might actually throw these on rather than my other shoes. So that's the Hocker shoes. Bridget, do you like those two guys in the back? All right. I'm going to head off. It's late and I've got to get my little baby child to sleep. Um, hope you enjoy this. Now, um, next week's post uh, on Tuesday, we're going to talk about um, drugs and anti-inflammatories for all different uh, types of foot, foot issues. So we'll talk about that n- uh, next Tuesday. All right, have a great night and we will see you soon. Thanks, Bridget. Yes, they do love making an appearance. They'll be appearing all the time. Hey, Sean, how are you? All right, have a good night, guys. Bye.